we've been claiming that Turkish judiciary is bound to Turkish government, and this is a new evidence for this uh, relation. And uh, our lawyers didn't go to the court today protesting this uh, political decision was made by Erdogan himself. And it's a personal uh, decision by the president of Turkey uh, to deter the journalists writing against him. The conditions for journalists in Turkey getting worse day by day. Uh, and only this decision can show us how brutal the conditions are. So there are still brave journalists defending the truth in Turkey. But uh, I, I hope the world is seeing much better now what kind of a government we are struggling against. Unfortunately, we are struggling against a cruel leader and a government, so nowhere is safe if you are challenging him, uh, even in Germany. And I've got a lot of threats, of course, but um, you don't have to consider this as, a, as an obstacle, because otherwise you couldn't do anything. So I'm here uh, working as a journalist, and I don't... I don't have any fear anymore because I was attacked by a gunman in Turkey just because of this news. I was jailed. Uh, now I am in exile. All our assets are confiscated. What else they can do? Without any evidence to support this decision. The problem is there's a cloud of fear over the country. So those decisions may deter some journalists in Turkey to write against the government, to write about the truth. But we are here uh, to write the truth, to defend the truth, so we keep on fighting for this.